Beautiful. Morning or afternoon for me, I guess. Yeah. Or evening or whatever. Happy time zone. Um, hi, Liz. Uh, I'm going to be uh, doing some... Beautiful. Um, I'm going to be doing... Uh, working on some co-working stuff today. Because um, I would like to do co-working streams on occasion in the future. Um, but... I don't know. Anyway, what, what are you doing here? You're don't you have a job? I just ate lunch, and I'm respecting my work life balance now. So that's fair. That's that's fair. Uh, hi, Fritz. Hi, Jinkar. You guys have jobs? Viv, you have a job. Um, so anyway, so yeah, um, I would like to do some like daytime co-working streams in the future. Um, this is my, my plan is this, um, I, what I would like to do long-term is do my consulting stuff, which involves me doing like dev and things like that for other people. And when I'm here working on stuff, cause eventually I will have like, um, I'll be doing it on my laptop over here because I've got the laptop. I got a spot set up for the laptop and the work phone and everything over here. So eventually the plan is that I would do co-working streams while I'm working on stuff um, over here and just like, you know, basically just chilling out. We can all chill out together while we do stuff and be productive together. You would like to consult me about something? Oh boy, here we go. What is co-working if not sitting besides people who share the job you do? You, and it doesn't even have to share the job as long as you're sitting together, working on stuff together. Um, then there you go. Um, so. Can you? Sorry, force of habit. No, no, it's okay. It's okay. Can you believe the audacity of Viv to make make us lose the game? Uh, I mean, I can believe no, that it. Sounds about, that sounds about par for the course, honestly. Yeah, that's 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 it. Well, too bad, Jinkar. He beat you too today. Parallel play, but with work. Yes. And Jinkar might be too busy to make us lose the game here soon. You know, with the with the second critter on the way. That's true. That's true. Jankar's got a second critter on the way. Louis and Ellie have a third one on the way. It's okay. We'll uh, we'll make them interns in no time and give them all the menial tasks. Things like pushing the button on the stream deck. I think it would stop sure. you. No, no, it would not stop you. Absolutely not. Um, faces button on the stream deck. Ouch. That's like personal. Um, all right. So what I want to do, what I want to do today, um, is the co-working setup. I want to do another browser source for this because I, I think that gives us like the most, that gives us the most like, uh, versatility, right? So let's. Let's get into let's get into it here. So the sidebar, I'm probably gonna make a new text file. Let's save this as stream files. Make this an HTML. We'll call. I'm just gonna call this cowork.html. I should have called it .htm. Make it like fucking eight dot three days. Filthy half stream, the buttons in your stream deck is half blank. Listen, buddy, I have I have entirely too many buttons on my stream deck. And then I have like I have my main stream deck is separated into pages and page four just has one button on it that goes into a sub page. So yours is simple, mine is overly complicated, as is most of the shit that I work on. As as is tradition. 
says the guy who exclusively uses HTML and JavaScript for all of the website shit he's been doing over the last like day or two. What am I supposed to do? Give me give me other languages that that a static page can do, please. Can make my my fucking uh Angular page that I have for Elena is is an Angular app. Yeah, but I don't want to have to build out a fucking Angular app and then have to scaffold all that shit. That's a that's a lot of work for something that's going to end up being not even 200 lines long. Is my point. Then then enjoy your JavaScript and HTML. That's what I'm saying. Uh, oh, and CSS. Sorry. Yeah. Sorry. Thank you. Thank you. I'm just I'm just saying you have options. Just cuz you're choosing not to use them. You know, You could just say you don't love me. That would just... I never said that. I'm just saying you... It would make things simple. If there wasn't love, there would be no never-ending possible. Oh, that's true. There is going to be never-ending possible. HTML. Yes. HT and the ML. She was set up and haven't streamed probably over a year. Yeah, but like... Liz, you've been, but you've been in school and holding down multiple jobs. So like you have priorities that you have, that you've, that you are, are setting to where they need to be, right? Your priorities are where exactly where they're supposed to be. You're taking care of the shit that you want and need to take care of for you. So I'm sure that you will eventually get back to a stream when you're ready and until then, keep doing the things that are best for you. That's it. That's all you got to do. You just keep taking care of you. That's it. You're doing good. Take care of business. Every day. Damn it. You're welcome. Why are you like this? No one knows that's half the fun. All right, I think I'm gonna we're gonna make this. I think we're gonna start with our typical black and white, or white on black, I guess. Um. Uh, I like the idea of using our usual font uh set up. So we're going to do that as well. I guess we could just. Um, okay. But you don't want to. I know, Liz. I know you don't want to. But you you know it's you know it's the best stuff that you're doing for you right now. You know what's fun about Windows 7? Go on, Viv. The fact that it was released in like 2009. When was Windows? When was Windows 7 released? It became generally available on October 22nd, 2009. Nailed it. Nailed it! And I got my college education while Vista was a thing. Yeah, you can't use Visual Studio Code. That's actually correct, buddy. That's true. That's true. I'm sorry. What? Hey, Viv, what's the latest Chrome that you have? What's the latest version of Chrome that you have? Notepad++. Notepad++ isn't bad, though. Like, does it have all the bells and whistles that VS Code does? Absolutely not. But at least Notepad++ has, like, it, ha it remembers state, and it can also do um, syntax highlighting, which is really... That's a big thing. Like the syntax highlighting for me, that's the biggest thing is I just want to see pretty colors in my shit. That's, I just want to see all the pretty colors. Just show me the colors. Notepad++ also has a fuck ton of plugins that'll probably get it very close to, if not on the same part. Like it won't 
for a, as a text editor, you can get it pretty goddamn close to Visual Studio. Code. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Um. Okay. So let's see. Also, I'm still just like. I'm still just. I still love that that works. That just makes me so happy. Send me a screenshot. Okay. It's of his duck. Um, you're on one oh nine, which isn't, which isn't bad, honestly. Like, what edge version am I on? One twenty, which, honestly. Isn't that fucking far ahead? I'm on a dev build too. That means I'm ahead. So. Do, do, do. So here, try this. It's not going to be exactly the same feature set. But try if you go to VS Code dot dev. Wait, there's is that a there's a new new theme? What hold setting? Wait, no, there was a theme. Preferences theme, color theme. What is dark modern? <gasps> there's a darker dark theme, Lolly. Ooh, is there a light modern to go along with it? And... Ah. I know it's bright. Ah. I know, I know. But ah. honestly, as light themes go, I don't hate it. And... Ah. <laughs> My eyes. There, there, you're fine. You're fine. <laughs> Quit your belly achings. No. There, anyway, uh... So there you go, v VS Code dot dev. Again, not full. It doesn't do like the full stuff, but it's. It doesn't do the full stuff. I wonder. Let's see. Oh, God damn. Huh. That's cool. That's actually really cool. So, yeah. Uh, here's my... The, the Zunderstream admin page is right there. File. That's open it. file. I can go to... Some stream files. Open the co work. There's the co work page there. That's pretty neat. But yeah, you can do you can do VS Code in the browser if you um, if you want the VS Code experience without all. It doesn't do everything, obviously, because again, browser versus like the installed version. But yeah, this can get you this can get you most of it. So it's pretty good. Okay. Anyway, let's come back over here. So we want to do the co-working setup. Um can I copy a path? Hey, look at that. Hey, look at that. Sweet. All right, let's do a Your father is back in town and thinking about trying to get back the job he quit in financial situation. I'll well, send him a fucking bill. Ah, <sighs> yeah, I am that petty bitch. 
Hi, Perny. What do? You should, Liz. You fucking should. Um, alright. I want to say that the... Um... Let's open the countdown. And I want to come up here and see that the body is, yep, okay. Ooh, I want that too. Yep, I do want that too. Uh, let's put co-work at the top here. I don't, I don't want untitled. M slap. Yeah, I know that feel, bud. I know that feel. I'm trying to do any, you know. And crochet and cry. Yeah. Oh, um, so I ordered the new camera. Hopefully it'll be here by the end of the week. So I'll be able to show you the camera. desk. Yeah, the camera. Does that mean you hit your sub goal? I, I did. I did. I hit the first one. I set up a second one. For more extra sub golan. Lolly is here. He's he's respecting his work life balance because he just had lunch. And he's not going straight back to work because fuck that noise. He needs he needs the break. Yeah. If that, they're gonna be on call, then they're getting they're getting my normal daytime hours and not and nothing more. Good. That's what they pay you for, is nothing more. Until they pay you for more, then they can Well they can get bent. Well, more than 250 bucks. Well, whatever. Um, all right, let's see. I want... I also want the letter spacing. That's what an H1 looks like in this thing? Jesus Christ. Well, that is... Uh, let's try larger and see what happens. That doesn't do anything. Um, how do I do font? Can, is there like a global scaling I can do? Font scaling. Mm, a late 22 addition to the CSS feature set. Container queries. Hmm. Font size two and a half of the viewport. Okay. I see KY. I know Gannett right. Hello, hello friend. How are you? Font size large. We just want large. Let's see. Let's see what the viewport scaling does. Oh, this is just the base, though. It's not changing the actual. Hmm. Okay. Let's. Oh wait, I'm changing. Oh my god. I'm doing it in the sidebar. No wonder it's not fucking. Okay, well, now that I come back over here. Let's try this. Hi, it's me, Stan. Hey, I know that guy from places such as my house.
Okay, that's better. You're better. Your face is better. Oh, get wrecked. <gasps> Ooh. Let's see if let's see if that scales. Ooh, it does. All right. Oh yeah, that's that's the good stuff right there. All right, let's pop this open in. Let's open the uh, Dev Tools. Let's set that up. Twenty-one sixty. All right, four is a little high. Let's take it back down to three. Three's not bad. Ice Bear needs it for everyday hustling. This nerd doing it. you're a nerd. Let's see. Gadget and Twitch why does Twitch always forget Gadget? Thank you for nine months, buddy. I really appreciate that. And font stretch. Yeah, but doesn't that just do width? Yeah, that just does width. I want I want like full scaling, but the the viewport size sizing works. So, gadget, thanks for the lurk, buddy, and thank you for the resub for nine fucking months, pal. I appreciate you. It's like a Star Wars crawl in the making. It probably is. Let's see. Um. Okay, and there we go. I wonder what I can do. Font Hecken Straunch, 69%. Nice. Nice. I, I dig it. I dig it. Let's see. All right. Um, I need... I feel like I need some kind of music again today. Go to game shops and see what they've got. Do they have any live? Oh, they do. Um, video game study lounge. Let's see what, let me see what the, uh, mm -hmm. you spell the stream safe to use the background music for live streams. Please link back or shout out game shops. Okay. Well then that's what we're going to do. There we go. What do you think about that, Lolly? Hey, I know this one. Yeah, you do. This is great. All right, we're going to leave the game shops on for a while. Love that. Okay. Um. So that works. Winning at co-working? Yes, I won co-working. It's done. It's over, Cash. We've, everybody pack it in. I have I have hundred percent of co-working. Speedrun champion for co-working. Um Hi Cash, how you doing, buddy? It's good to see you. Alright, let's go in here. Now let's go in studio mode and OBS. Uh let's go to Put up the mission accomplished banner, folks, right? All right, let's go. Co-working. Thanks, Viv. Yeah, Gannett, I'm, uh, I'm doing a little bit more stuff on stream for working on the stream. So we'll see how it goes, you know. Um, I've been enjoying doing this lately. It gives me, you know, a little something, something to to work on. 
All right, and now let's go. Let's take in, copy that. Beautiful. And See, any tips on setting up co-working stream stuff? Please let you know. I've been doing it for a year. I'm still such a new buddy. You're, you are light years ahead of me. I've been doing it for twenty minutes. <laughs> Nailed it, Viv. Nailed it. Uh, snailed it. Snailed it. Alright, we're gonna we're gonna lock that in place for now. And I'm gonna go ahead and hide it. Uh, I do want to do a transition on that, so I guess we don't have to refresh it and Eh, it's fine. You know what? It's fine. <gasps> Hi, Kitty. Kitty, what are you up to? You know, a lot of stuff set up really quickly and make it look professional. I Listen, I'm... Here's what's going to happen, Cash. I'm going to get it set up. And I'm going to look at it and go, yeah, this is pretty nice. And then about 30 seconds later, I'm going to look at it again and go, this is garbage. I hate it. And I'm going to start it over. Recovering from the flu? Oh, boo. Kitty, I'm sorry. I hope you're feeling a little better, at least. It's that time of year. Shit's going around. I'm glad I got my I got my pokey pokes for the season uh, a few weeks ago, so... Went to a concert, had a great time, but got the flu. Yeah, that's... Yeah. That'll happen. That's the risk, isn't it? But hopefully you had a, you know, it was worth the time that you had. It sounds like it. And you hate UI. Yeah, I love UI. I just, I'm just, I always want to fuck with it. Always. Honestly, I'm surprised that this over here has stayed here as long as it has. Like, this has pretty much been this way, aside from the news bar being animated now. Like, the only thing that has changed over here is the news bar being animated and having multiple rotating messages. Like, when I first started, where's one of my old streams? Let's let's go back in the archives a little bit. Like, I can go and look. We can go way the hell back. Good lord. Oh hey, look, there's a there's the bot saying, hey, by the way, go look at YouTube. Okay. Like this is YouTube has to spin up servers like collecting dust in a closet somewhere because this is fucking almost three years old now. Oh, come on. Now they're just being mean. But you can, like, I have this. Like, this over here has changed quite a bit. That's before I changed my username on Twitter. That's when I still had a fucking Twitter. But like this over here, and then like all this shit behind me, like the robe wall is even more expanded now than it used to be. This was back when Lolly first started watching me when I was playing fucking Monster Sanctuary. 
me being like fucking lazy. Look how look how lazy I am. So lazy. This was a script in OBS. Yeah, YouTube's like, mm, I don't think so. I don't think so. But like, this was actually OBS doing this as a script before I made a browser source for it. This was all graphical, I think. Like, this was part of a... Uh, this part and that part right there were uh, graphic parts in Photoshop. And this is when I had the camera extended over more. But yeah, like the title over here, the title has not changed. This part, this part is the only part of the stream right here that has not changed since day one. And I'm just like, you know what? We'll let it, we'll let it stay for a while. We'll let it stay. I, I don't know. I'm kind of attached to it. And unless I completely change the, the design of the stream. Like I'm never going to, I'm never going to get away from it. I think, you know, unless I like the only other like big design thing that I have that's different is like the TV, which I love the TV. The TV's great, but you know, that's a whole different setup on its own. Faces. You're set up your face. Oh, I hate when it does that. There we go. Set up your face. No, I will. I, I cannot do that for you, Kitty. I'm sorry. But also, yes, you should get your flu shot. Okay, so the, the scalings. Hmm. Code your face to look better. I'm um, sorry, Pernt. They they don't make code to improve upon that. So you just have to stick with the good face that you already have. Get wrecked or whatever. Um. All right. I'm gonna take out the header text, like the H1 here, because we're just gonna. Uh, Pern, I have seen your face several times. Don't, don't try to, don't try to bullshit me. You can't shit a shitter. Clockwork, the interest rate has gone up again. Ooh, wait, like your savings interest rate? Because if so, yes. Filters you can add into OBS. Well, that's, I mean, that's true, but... Have to pay more money. Oh, that's not fun. That's 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 a bad kind of interest rate going up. <laughs> the wrong interest. All right, let's go. Can I? I'm tempted to do a gradient here. Let's see how this works. Oh, it has to be. Oh, it has to be background image. I see. Okay. No wonder it doesn't auto do that. Okay. Linear gradient. Wait, we can just linear gradient now. Look at that. Uh, let's go white. Well, I want to go. And we'll go. Is it RGBA or ARGB? Fuck, I can never remember. Uh, 
color. Okay. Well, I guess I have to go return to capitalist society now. Ooh, don't be, don't be capitalist. I mean, you know, this is the game that we were dealt, so. Okay. Yeah. Have fun, go, buddy. Do me a code monkey. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. And Lolly's gone. Lolly, everybody says that they love you. Well, mostly just burnt, but, you know, that counts. The, the one place that hasn't been corrupted by capitalism. Space. God bless Tim Curry. Yes, Pernt. You nerd. It does count. Uh, let's see. Does this... I wonder how that works. Oh. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. Tim Curry for Supreme Ruler of Space. I love it. Uh, Duncan, Duncan. Oh God, Duncan. Fucking, I want donkeys now. Oh, I want donkeys now. Love donkeys. Ah, uh, all right. Let's see. We're going to do a couple of things here. One, we're going to make the header. Got to go yell at Magnon. Okay, go yell at Magnon. Donkeys, but it'll probably be made wrong. No, Viv, that's, that's part of the appeal. It's like a little game. It's like, how will they fuck it up today? Did I, did I tell you all about the thing the other day where I went to Starbucks and like, they got they got a little detail in my drink wrong, which is fine, but then like I asked them to fix it and so okay, so I always get a mocha frappuccino, right? I get the big boy, I get it with extra pumps of mocha, and I get the drizzle on top. Cause, you know, chocolate, right? It's just it's just chocolate milk for grown ups. So I order this thing like I always do, and I get a coffee for bean also. So I, I go and I pick them up and I accidentally tell it that I'm going to pick it up in store instead of the drive through And I'm like, well, I don't want to, you know, cause a fuss. So I walk in the store, I pick it up and they have beans drink is fine. And they have mine, uh, chalky milk with coffee nudes. What's up, buddy? How are you? It's good to see you, pal. Um, so beans drink is fine. And then mine just doesn't have the drizzle on it. I'm like, all right. Cause they, they do that sometimes. So I take the lid off. I'm like, Hey, can you, can you add the drizzle for me? And the guy takes it and he's like, yeah, he's like, just next time, uh, make sure you put it in the app so Reverse. that you don't have to Reverse. Ranger. Hi buddy. Uh, he's like, next time, can you just, he's like, next time, make sure you put it in the app. So, you know, that we know beforehand and you don't have to ask. And I'm like, look at the cup and you're on the sticker, six pumps of mocha. Mocha drizzle. He's like, oh, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm like, it, like, it's fine. Like, and again, my thing is like, don't, it's like forgetting the, the drizzle. That's not a problem, but like, yeah, don't, don't automatically blame the customer for your mistake. Take two seconds to look and validate and be like, oh, you're right. That was on there. Instead of just like, no, you fucked this up. It's like, pal, that's. You don't want to do that. You don't want to do that. Um, Ranger, how you doing, buddy? How's the work going for you? Uh, Jinkar, I apologize in advance for this spot. Reverse! Reverse! Know you. Uh, 
I like shorthand hex colors. Sue me. Cash, thanks for the lurk. <gasps> Hi, Toya. Two hops this time. Who gave you a sub? Yeah, it was it was anonymous. It was anonymous. Okay, so that doesn't work. Um, I wonder how I can do... Ooh. Can I do... Oh, yeah. Oh, I like that. Um, I'm working just big chilling. Nice, nice. Uh, I'm doing okay, Toya. I'm uh trying to figure out like the co working setup. Like, I, I want to have like a little something on the screen while we're doing co working stuff just to like let people know, hey, we're doing stuff today. Um, so that's my that's my big project right now. Come on, Ranger. It's around here. We anonymous is usually one person, unless it's a nani moose. You know. So co-working is the idea of basically, it's like having another body in the room. Um, they sometimes call it like body doubling, um, where you just sit with someone while you're doing work, so that you know you're not just trying to do work by yourself. You have someone in the room. It's like you kind of feeding off that energy to say, okay, hey, I'm I'm working on stuff, you know, so you can come and chill out and work on stuff too. And just, again, having that just another person in the room almost to like keep you accountable. Um, so kind of like study trims. Yes. Yes. Very much like that, Ranger. Absolutely. Same, same energy. All right, we're just going to call this post header and see what happens. It's body doubling with viewers. Yep. Yep. That's exactly it. That's not bad. What's bold? 700? I feel like bold is 700. It's, that's not bad. Hard to focus while listening to someone play games sometimes. Yeah, exactly. Yep. Where I could be lucky it's just, it doesn't make funny voice acting quips. Uh, I don't know that we've talked about it, but... I mean, we could we could make that happen, probably. Bigger? Well, here, let's see what it looks like. Uh, ooh, I have an idea. Let me put a let me put a button on the stream deck for it. Um, OBS source visibility on the. Default overlays, co-working. I'm not the one who said bigger. Pern's the one yelling it. And That's not bad. Pernt is Pernt is a size queen. It's true. Um, all right, 
right, let's... I like that better. I like it with more of a gradient to it. And why is they... Is that just a visual artifact? Okay. That's fine. Let's see. Bigger is sometimes better, all right? Sometimes. I'll visually artifact your face. But he's in for others. Wow. Shut. Viv, shut the fuck up. Uh, wait a minute, wait a minute. How do I flex items to left and right? Left and right. Oh, align self. Okay. Well, it's Greek to you. That's fair. This is... I wonder if this works. It does work. Okay. As we do left and right, so. Uh, I gotta change header. Okay, that's, I think that's correct, but I have to fix the width. And Oh, main isn't a hundred percent. And okay. Huh. Hmm. No, I will not stop being mean to Viv. That's what he gets for making me lose the game earlier. Justify content space between. Let's try that and see what happens. There we go. Okay. Ranger, we really are. We're only 400 bucks away from $5,000, and I want us to hit that by the end of the month if we can. So, um... I'm really, really hoping that we can get there. 
Um, this has been a great campaign. Uh, I do want us to wrap it up soon, though. I know with the holidays coming and everything like that. Um, it's just we've we've had this open for a while. And I know I said I was going to probably run it close to the end of the year, but I think I think end of November is a pretty good place to close it out. So I want us to hit that as soon as we can. That'd be just fantastic. Okay. Let's do margins. Uh, let's do zero and then let's do 80 and see how that looks. Oh, that's what I need to do. All right. Um, calc. Buddy. Uh, you just bought a car battery. Thanks, Bean. Now we're... Now we're only $300 away from our goal. Um, I'm going to go post about I got you, babe. <laughs> babe. Bean is best bean. It's true. All right, let me... I can't I can't work in light boxes. Okay. Uh let's see. All right, so space between seems like it works, and we have to change that to padding, not margins. Yep, padding's inside the box, margin is outside the box. There we go. Uh, 80's a little, a little much, so let's scale it back to 40. That's nice. What do y'all think? Do you like that? Do you like the please relax and enjoy thing, or is that... Is that too much? Should we just... I'll leave it for now. We'll see what happens. We'll play it by ear, as we do. Hmm... Not black box, we can't see that. No, I mean like the the actual thing up there where it says co working today and please relax and enjoy like I'm just curious about 
like the thing that's actually up there. I like it. I think I'll leave it for now. Like this part right here that's up there. I heard a jingle jangle. That can only mean one thing. It's a kitten's cat. Do I have my overflow hidden? Uh, no, but I should. Okay. Dang, that's true. Dang, Bean, you're right. Mm. Mm. Bean, which lunchy did you take today? And was it any good? It was good, but mostly pasta. Maybe the beef and broccoli will be... Uh, is it beef and broccoli? I think it's beef and broccoli, right? Yeah. You brought nuggies for a snack? That's a good idea. I love a nuggie. You want food, buddy? I always want food. Ah, Batsy. How are you? Okay. I got the gradient the way I want it to, so that's nice. You have a McGriddle? Oh, fucking love a McGriddle. Oh, love a McGriddle. Hi, Chirpy. Wanna come? Oh, there's a sweet girl. Let me say hello to everyone. Let me say hi. There's a kitty cat. Can you say hello? What is he doing? You being sweet girl? Yeah? That's my kitty. Everybody loves the kid and his cat. That's right, because she's a sweet girl. There she goes. And there she goes. Sweet girl. Sweet girl? Yeah. She's had very many things to say to me today. We've been talking a lot today. I took a shower earlier and she was sitting on the rug in front of the shower just waiting for me to get out. And as soon as I turned the water off and opened the shower door, she just started talking to me. She's like, hey, what are you doing? Where you been? Why is the shower so loud? I love you. Those are probably the things that she was saying. Is that right, though? Yeah, that's right. Oh, hello. Oh, that's a very good. You want to go get strawberry? There's a strawby. Strawby's over there. Oh, you just want some pets? <laughs> She's just sitting. Giving some snuggles for a strawby. There's a strawby. Oh my god, her blep yesterday. She's a little... Mm, mm, little blep. Mm. You know, blep. Yeah, she did a very good blep. She doesn't blep very often, but when she does, it's the best little blep. She's the best kitten's cat. She's just a baby. Uh, Loaf will be three uh, at the end of January. She was one when we got her, um, and that has been almost two years now. Oh, God, bug snacks. Hey, Batsy, remember that time Vivcons you into 100%ing bug snacks? Those were good times. And it was worth it. What? What's she telling me? What's she saying? Here's a strawby. Where's your strawby? Where's your buddy? There's a box on the floor and she is just rubbing her face on it. She's so excited about the box. Yeah, it feels so good giving her little scratches on her face. Yeah. Yeah. She's just a sweet girl. Yeah, she's the best kitten's cat. 
I took it off Game Pass here to look up the true ending. Oh no! Yeah, I never did finish Bug Snacks. I should have. Uh, I keep talking about going back and finishing my time at Porsche so that I can finish that up. Actually, I might start it over. I might. I don't know. I think Porsche is still on Game Pass. Let me see. Yeah, it's on Game Pass still, because the Deluxe Edition you can buy with the Game Pass discount. There it is. Oh, it's even... They still have it Cloud Gaming, too? Damn. I wonder if they ever ported back any of the PC bug fixes to the console version. I sincerely doubt it. Sincerely doubt it. Nothing like saying Porsche to get you out of lurk. Hi, Max. <laughs> it's like catnip for Mags. Mags is like, Porsche, where? Where? I mean, it's still on Game Pass, so... I wonder if it's... Uh... Can I put it on the one? No, that's not... Oh, I haven't turned that one on in a while, so I have to turn that one on. <laughs> catnip. And then catnip is catnip for cash. It's not her fault, it's just, you know, when you're a cat, it's just how it works. You're a kitty? Oh, you are? That's good. That's very good. Good job. You gave me a meow. Hmm. Boop. Boop, boop. Oh, hello. 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 No. Uh, Liz, I was saying that uh, I am thinking about going back and finishing my time at Porsche because Sandrock is out, and I might end up playing that at some point too. But I gotta, I gotta play. I gotta finish Porsche first. You're just, it's only, it's only right. No love for what you're doing. What are you doing? Being a kitty. She's the very best kitty. She's a sweet girl. Oh, has it made bug snacks also made Octodad? Oh, I didn't know that. But those seem like the same kind of vibes, so that makes sense to me. Oh, all right, let's go and you know what? Son of a, right, we're going to do new text file. Uh, we're going to save this as Thunderstream base dot JS. Yeah. Okay. And dehydrated landscape boogaloo. That's you're, you're not wrong. It's buggy if it's worth it. Oh, it's even it's even buggier on console, I assure you. Cash, thanks for the lurk. I hope work goes well. Um All right, we're gonna just In PS4. Okay, then you yep, then you know all about it. Boy, howdy. Check promo image. All right, so then... Uh, oh, let me grab the one from the retro countdown, because here I have one to set custom variable also. Nope, didn't mean to do that. Um... I didn't fuck up the sidebar, did I? I probably did, and I don't care. 
All right. There we go. Beautiful. And switch. The born babies are half embedded in the ground. Oh, switch. Never change. Okay. That'll do that. I think that means that I should be able to get stuff here that are... Uh, Alright, I don't want the countdown. I don't think I want the sidebar anymore at this point. Let's just keep this open so I don't break anything. Display flex. Let's go position absolute. No. Mm. Fixed. Top. Zero. Left. Zero. That should still be okay. And then post header. Yeah. Unfortunately, because you can glitch yourself thousands of. I ain't mad at it. If only we could, uh, if only we could manipulate capitalism that way. Oh, maybe that's why that was busted. Because I had, yeah. Oh, this is a song that Lolly wouldn't like at all. Kitty. Where'd you go? There she is. Hi, sweet girl. That's my kitten's cat. That's my kitten's cat. There's a puppy doing a big snoozle behind me. <gasps> Is it a Nyx puppy? Is she being a very good girl? She's a very good girl. She's just a baby. No, she's just a baby. Are you just a baby, though? Yeah. Just a baby kitty. She a void. Yeah. She void doggo. Oh, I know why. Font, wait, text, align, right. Left. Okay, that doesn't work. Yep, right now. The big tap taps when you get home. Oh, love when they do the big tippy tappies. She just a baby. You're just a baby. Yeah, that's you, baby. Yeah, that's right. Oh, so many pets. Well, she really wants all the pets today. She's being a snuggly cat. You snuggly cat, you know? Yeah, she's a sweet girl. 
I'm gonna get in the chair. Where's your chair? I'm gonna get in the chair. No, is that not close enough to the bear? The chair's too far away, huh? You just want to get all the pets. I know. She's my sweet girl. Hi, sweet girl. I know she's just a kitten. She's the best kitten in the whole world. No, Strawby is in the chair, and she's just, she's not interested in the chair right now. She's just walking around me, just giving snuggles. She's now being a toolbox kitty. She's now right in front of my knee. Sleep in the big bed tonight. Oh, oh, she won't do paw right now. She's, she's, now she's laying down on the toolbox under the desk in front of me. Cause she's just a baby. I don't understand why that doesn't work. Oh, I know exactly why that doesn't work. Because I am a dingus. Okay, now let's see if it works. That somehow isn't any better. No, that's... Okay, get out of here. Margin left auto. Car says, what's going on, buddy? How are you? Oh, there's a kitten cat. Oh, the creature is vibrating. I don't know if you got some purpers. Is there a good purpers? Yeah. Oh, she does a big purper. Oh my goodness. What a purper. Row, a row. Boy, when Bean left for work this morning, she hollered. She's like, "Hello, hello." She she missed her Bean this morning. Well, it's it's a Final Fantasy song remix. I mean, it's the they use that prelude in, in a lot of them. Okay, maybe I can make this a grid. Yeah, let's let's display it as a grid. And then we don't need this in here. Oh, I don't like that at all. Oh. We'll do that as an inline block. And... Oh God, what did... What what have they done now, Tom?
Why? Am I, am I forgetting? I'm probably forgetting how to do. All right. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll go to the W3 schools one. Oh, I see. So that's not how that works, then. There's a my.cnf that's... <clears throat> oh, yada, yada. I can't import... Program DB. Oh, God. No, I want, yeah, I want MDN. Okay. What in the absolute fuck is happening here? And three other possible reasonable CSS because then they were tables. This is also they actually overlap in layers, similar CSS back. Oh, I see. I see. Just be told that it can auto extend. <laughs> it says has no such Alright, let's go. Grid row one grid um one or two. I mean we can try this and see what happens. I'm gonna Oh hey, that does work. Do I like Disney and do I like Minecraft? Uh, yes and yes. Um, actually, there was a thing in Minecraft uh, Bedrock a while back with like a thing where you could walk around the Magic Kingdom and shit, which was really cool. I don't, I don't know what you mean, Liz. I, I wouldn't know anything about llamas that take over our entire fucking existence in our Bedrock realm. That never happened. Remember the days before autocomplete? Oh man. Those are, those are dark times indeed. Okay. Oh, I guess the post header needs to be below the header. Yeah, because that's... Pepperidge Farm rumors happening tonight at 9. Would you like the details? Um, you can DM it to me. I don't know if I'll be able to do anything, but um, shoot me over the details, sure. Uh, let's see. Wait. We're going to do something different.
Okay. It was with me. I'm shocked that that worked the first time. Join most of the admins will be there. Nice. Uh, if I get a chance, CKY, I'll check it out. Um, I don't know that I will tonight. Uh, part of, that's part of the reason why I do. An, I'm doing a daytime stream, but. If I get a chance to, I will. Thanks, bud. Um, okay, so that's good. That's fine. Now I want one at the bottom. That should be fine. Oh, shit. Wait, can I do right zero? Can I do right zero? <laughs> gotcha. Cody Coworky. Yeah. Hi, Karen. How are you? Viv, go make some foods. Make some foods. CKY, if you want to post a thing about it in the uh, the self-promo channel, you can. It's probably the best place for it. In the, uh, in the old discord Roni there. Man, I love that we got grid and flex layouts in CSS. God. So good. Karen, you stop that. I love you. Uh, where is, now we're going to move this up. Yeah, this will be our pre-footer. Pre-footer, main footer. New wizard, oh God, what have they done now? All right. Footer. We're going to do a similar thing with it, but we're going to do it from the bottom instead of the top. And then the... They released an ad with AI art. Oh my god. It's like the Florida Man games, but Wizards of the Coast. Literally thousands of artists. Imagine, imagine employing thousands of artists and then looking right, looking at them square in the face and going, ha ha ha, fuck you guys. Ah. Uh. I wonder if that works. Pretty neat. Mm. 
There's the kitten's cat just on my toolbox. She's a sweet baby. That's my kitty. You love your kitten. Oh, she's a sweet girl. She's very good. Mm, what's she doing? Oh, kisses. Oh, there's kisses. Oh, that's good kisses, thank you. Thank you for the kisses, little loaf. She's a sweet girl. Your other job. Boo, other job. See, remember what I was saying? Remember what I said, Liz? Holding down multiple jobs out here. Going to school. Job. Georgerb. All right, that's. Wait, why did that do it in there? There we go. Oh, that's pretty nice. Um, although the line height I'm not a huge fan of. It's God, this font is just like this font is laid out weird for web, and I don't like the way it is, because the baseline for it is so low, but the height is so tall. We're gonna do I'm going to add to the main footer down here and we're going to do a padding bottom of, let's see if 10 helps. 10's, 10's okay. I think I'm going to make it 20 though to be more consistent with the top. Yeah, that looks better. You know what? I might do that to both. Mm. Yeah, that's fine. All right, so let's refresh it over here. That's not bad. I like that. Hmm. Okay, and the grid layout can go away. I got that all squared away now. Hmm. All right, what can we do with the bottom here? Um, all right, I'm going to give these IDs, I think. Let's give them some IDs. ID equals, let's do footer left. And do for the right. Document dot on add event listener content loaded.
Early's under stream. Yeah, daytime's under stream. Hi, Dennis. How you doing, buddy? Yeah, I'm working on a little co-streaming sort of like layout up here to show so like I can for future like daytime co-working stream kind of deals. Um, I could do, let's do this. I'm going to do post header, three footer. Very long day of college to get used to that. Working on C plus plus. Ooh, C plus plus is. I'm not. I'm not smart enough to do C plus plus. I think I like that better. C++ scares me. That's too much power for me. I'm afraid I'll set something on fire. It's just... It's, it's too much. 25 gig for three people's test database? And still prefer C... What, C over C++? How come CKY? Your pointery language of choice is Go nowadays. Mm-hmm. A lot of people really like Go. Um, I haven't tried it out. Um, I don't know. I'm just... I like... I'm lazy, and I like languages and frameworks that do shit for me, and boy howdy, is that why I love C-sharp and .NET? Because it does so much for you. It just... You know, no classes, you have to use more brain power. To me, that's just like... That's working harder instead of smarter. I don't know. It's just... Goes really weird if you like how to waste Java slash C sharp works. Mm. Program C plus plus fire extinguishers. If I if I would if I were to make fire extinguishers in C plus plus, they would spontaneously combust. That's what would happen. I know this. I know this. All right. Let's see. So I got to do something with the bottom there. Okay. Hate Java. I Java is why I dropped out of college the first time. Because I also know C sharp and Java is like what if we took like it's it's just like what if I took the same concepts that I know from C sharp but I made everything needlessly bullshitty. It's the way Java feels to me. And Java had the whole dream of being like, Java runs everywhere on everything, and it does it, but it's like, not great. And then C Sharp comes around and like, it took him fucking 15 years. But it's like, hey, C Sharp runs on everything now. It actually runs on everything. And I'm like, you son of a bitch, I'm in. I mean, I was already in because it's C Sharp, but I'm, all, I'm, I'm in even more. Java runs everywhere, just slowly, yeah. Yeah. Java's why you quit programming. Yeah, I mean, mm, the reason goes that there's a wrapper library around the HID spec for the Agato Stream Deck. HID calls and implement them yourself. That's fair. That's fair. I mean, if you can, you know, build out your own Stream Deck manager and, and, and shit for Linux using a Go library, fucking... More power to you, pal. I know that'll be... Hey, where are you going? Where are you going, gay cat? What are you doing? Nice. Oh. Were you taking... Did you take a little mini cat nap? Yeah. Yeah. Did you take a little nap nap? Little cat snap? I know. I know I love you. Yeah, that's my kitty cat. It's very sweet. 
Oh, she's so sweet. Loaf, Loaf took a tiny nap on the toolbox, I think. It's actually been a blast figuring things out. Nice. Java when you were young and in college. Yeah, Java, I just mm, could not do it. Actually, when I was um, in, when I went to college during that time, they had just swapped from using C++ to Java in the comp sci courses, and I'm just like, no. Mm-mm, can't do it. Like I'm this I'm like this is this is terrible and I hate it and that's why I dropped out the first time. Alright, let's go. Um Never went to college. I it took me, I don't know, fifteen years to finish my four year degree. And then Fargo in the fall of ninety nine. Mm. Tarot app has been updated to the latest Android version. Nice, Liz. Very nice. Freshman class was the first ones to start learning it. Yeah, yeah, mine was too. This was in two thousand three. I was just, mm -mm. I got, th I slogged through. Comp Sci 1 and then Comp Sci 2 came around and I'm like, you know, I'm, I'm just not doing this. And the worst, I think what really ruined it for me is the professor didn't know it either. He was kind of learning it along with the rest of us because he had been doing C++ forever. And uh, it was just, yeah, it was it was not a great time. Uh, I want to lift some code out of here too. Let's go lift some code. The footer left. If or there's one, uh, architecture course ninety eight. Mm. The teachers learning along with us having that center plus plus time. Yeah, I just like I know that's tough when you know someone else sets the curriculum, but oof. What if I just set heights on these things? I'm just gonna, we're just gonna height. There you go. I don't even need, I don't even need padding because I got heights. What if I do 140? Yeah, that's fine. Structural engineering is where you're going. Mm, gotcha. I thought about doing some kind of a physical engineering degree. Actually, I thought about doing electronic engineering at one point. But uh, I ain't that smart. That's, that's, that's lots of maths and things. All right, let's go in here.
That's a level of what the hell math. You're not kidding, pal. All right, let's. Well, I like that. I God, I wish it didn't put it in quotes. Really wish it didn't put it in quotes. Let's go to the server API. Controllers, custom variable. Oh, because it spits it out as fucking JSON. That's why. It's technically a JSON formatted value. Uh, I mean, I, I can. I can. I just have to do it on this side instead of the, the bot side. Because on the bot side, it doesn't have quotes. So I have to do like, this is the thing that I was doing last night where I have to do like, where I basically take and do a regex where I pull any quotes from the beginning or the end of the string and do it. So when I refresh it now, there it is. Yeah, because when you, here, I'll show you. when I get it from the bot, and because it's technically JSON formatted, it comes in with the quotes. So, like it's, I get why it does it. I'm just not a fan of it, but it's fine. It's fine. And, uh, I'm using, I'm using name, so it gets the raw value. Yeah, it's it's the way that endpoint is set up. Yes, yes, it does. It it sh it should only because when we get custom, we return get custom variable, but we wrap it in a response dot JSON instead of like a response dot text. Or like response dot I forget whatever whatever the hell the other one is. Um or like a response dot send. So because of that, um we it it puts the quotes in for us. Because it's JSONifying a string which means when it returns a JSONified string response, it's going to put it in quotes. So for something like a Boolean or a number, it won't add the quotes. For a string, it does. Because that's technically the JSON. Yeah, it's a JSON formatted string. Which, again, is fine. It's just I have to work around that. That's... Um, that's probably going to be a version 6 thing where I change that. Either way, uh, okay, on, even on get, I'm doing it, I'm getting it by the name. Yeah. I, either way, I, I, I both get and set by name. So. Now, if I get, like, all the custom variables, I think, can I, do we have an endpoint for that? And, yeah, we do. 
Now I think for get custom, like just get custom variables, it will do it as a full JSON object, which at that point, if you traverse the object, it's fine. But because it's returning just the single value and not as an object, then it adds in the quotes for string values. So uh, when we get to a point where I can start doing V6 dev stuff, yes. We are not at that point yet, though. We are we are not ready for that yet. Just with, hell, we're behind on V5 stuff, much less V6. All right, so I'll do that. Nope. Two. Right. Excuse me. Oh, I you know I don't like good and bad news. Okay, that's two, two, two. One, one, one. Perfect. <clears throat> Your last contract ended on the ninth. I need a new contract. Oh boy. Boy, how do I need one? It's something I'm going to be working on soon is drumming up some, some work for myself because I need it. <clears throat> so I'm assuming that's the bad news. Oh, that's the good news. Oh boy. Oh, it's both. Okay. So the bad news is the contract and the good news is you have way more free time than you need. Or is it the other way around? <clears throat> Man, I got a little dry spot in my throat. I hate when that happens. Yeah. Anything that has to fire about Discord that's clear before you continue on it. Um, uh, Uh, is this like the user ID versus username thing, Dennis? Is that what you're asking about? Mm -hmm. In the user DB? Um, so we've talked about that in the past. Um, <clears throat> and... While we want to update that, so much of the underpinnings of Firebot v5 is based around username that it would break functionality for a lot of shit if we 
change up the way that user database, like how we drive decisions based on the user database. So I've, I brought this up, you know, in the past and we, we really don't want to fuck with that user database very much just because of the potential that it has to break so much shit. And there's a few some holy hell, what, what a banger before you remember that's your own playlist. Nice, Tom. Just the way it's accessed in other functions. Well, that's what I mean is like we don't want to fuck with it too hard. We we don't want to fuck with like that too hard in V5. Like that has far reaching implications of what what could break with existing functionality today. Yes, it is absolutely something that we want to change. Like we're even we're looking at like different data storage um altogether in version six. Cause right now, like the JSON database stuff is just not great. Um but if we change how we access stuff in the user database now, it could break a bunch of existing stuff in I've already broken too much shit in the last year. So I'm I'm not going to be the one to say yes because I don't want to um I don't want to be the one to to you know be the reason shit breaks again. I already broke stuff once this year. It is an early stream, Dommy. It's a it's for me it's a daytime stream. Hi buddy. You just don't want to be responsible, CKY. That's why. <clears throat> okay, the margins over here, as opposed to, mm, that's going to bother me. I think that's going to bother me, isn't it? Yeah, it probably is. It's 2,000% why, yeah. <clears throat> Well, 80, well, if I put it back to 80, is that going to actually be okay? Well, there we go. Okay, that's not bad. Hey, there's a null. <clears throat> Wait a minute. Does it return, like, null as an actual string? It returns null as an actual string. Ah. <clears throat> uh. It returns null. <clears throat> Let me open Let me open Postman and see what happens. Yeah, Postman's allowed. Oh my god. <clears throat> Okay. Clean ID.
Ice Bear needs it for everyday hustling. <clears throat> Dennis, buddy, thank you for the Prime sub. I really appreciate that. Oh, this is... I don't want... I don't want fucking WebSocket and... Oh, right. I forgot the V1. Yeah, see, it returns... It returns a string of null. It doesn't return nothing. It returns an actual string of null when it doesn't exist. If it's an empty string, it returns an empty string. If there, if it doesn't exist, it returns as null. Yeah, if I type in blah, 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 it's null. If I go into Firebot and make it an empty string, it returns an empty string. And now, now it's an empty string in quotes. Because quotes. Because quotes. Yeah. <clears throat> yep. <clears throat> yep. <clears throat> so non-existent ones, it returns null. Uh, existing ones that are empty, it returns back an empty string inside of quotes. Go figure. Go, go figure. Oh yeah, always. All right. Um, <clears throat> actually, I might put the please relax and enjoy down at the bottom. Co work footer message two. There we go. And then the one at the top, I may just say. I don't need what I'm working on because, well, I guess I got the. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm going to rename these variables because I already don't like them. This is exactly what I keep talking about. And Yeah, this this music is pretty great. I love this. This is good. I was just omitting the null. Well, that's nice. Thanks. Thanks, API client. Yes, Tom, we love your playlist. Well done, Tom.
uh, Moody Blues you listened to. Uh, the body was four bites, but showed an empty body. I feel like that's not correct. Oh, I never added the way to, uh... <clears throat> okay, let's get rid of that. Get rid of that. I saved that. It's not bad. I think it's unreliable. Well, maybe maybe there's like a setting to I don't know, not auto format responses or some shit that it's just you can just switch off. Okay, now my the next thing that I want to do is Save that. Save that. Turn that off. Back on. Okay, everybody's text is there, and the only one that's not the only one that's static is the co working one. Son, hey, good to see ya. you. Because and then later on, uh, you're very welcome. You're very welcome. Good to see you. It's been a minute. Hope you're doing well. All right. Now we're going to do. Yeah. Okay. We can show it when it shows up. We'll do the we'll do the changing messages in a few. Most of the time you don't have much to say. That's that's okay. We really appreciate our lurkers around here. Um it's I I like to lurk quite a bit myself. Just got a lot going on. Um and love to have my friends on in the background so I can, you know, feel like I'm hanging out even though I can't really do a whole lot. UTF file, one keyboard is Python's different. The same character, but different bytes. Unicode is fucky. Unicode is fucky. I mean, it's not bad, it's just fucky. So those are fine for now. We'll come back to this. Now let's come over here. All right. And why Unicode? Why you do this to me? Yeah, pretty much. 
Okay, div id equals this, classes menu section. Okay. H2 co-work setup. All right. Now let's go and add a bunch of inputs here. We're just going to Now we're going to go co-work header right Oh, left, right. Okay, beautiful. New coding and application site tool, maybe hacking the NSA. No, uh, so what I'm doing right now is this is a, uh, a page that I'm propping up to use as a browser source. So if you look up here, you can see there's a white bar at the top and bottom of the content area of the stream right now. That's the one that I just faded out, and I'll fade it back in. Um, so I'm working on a co-streaming setup, just a, like a little scene to show while we're working on stuff um, for future streams where we're co-working. And we're just, you know, we may not be talking a whole lot, or I may not be talking a whole lot on stream um, during like work periods, but it has something in the background. Um, so, you know, if, if you're working on stuff and you just need a little something in the background and have somebody else in the room virtually with you um, while you're working just to encourage you to have a little bit of you know motivation to work yourself then uh, we've got that and then um, eventually what will happen is in future streams I'll probably be over here turned and working on my laptop um, working on work stuff um, but that's what I'm I'm kind of setting this up to do and this is a little more interactive than it would be in the future um, at least during like the the, the working portions because we're you know working right now but um you know again just uh kind of just hanging out and you know we're all we're all kind of working on our own things but doing it together so but yeah that's kind of uh that's kind of our thing Let me make sure. Okay, cool. Let's see what we got going on now. All right, that's good. Now let's come back here. <clears throat> All right, let's go. Go back to MDI. I want to see save. <clears throat> what saves do we have? Ooh, we got briefcases. Ooh, I like that. We got a briefcase. Oh, I like the briefcase check. Oh, I like that quite a bit. And, all right, we're going to do that one. <clears throat> Best hacking tool, social engineering. You better believe it. You better believe it. 
What's being one for dinner? Speaking of pizza, um, I got some chicken thawing out right now. Some chicken thighs. We're probably going to do lemon pepper chicken thighs and some mashed potatoes and some green beans. I think we still have some green beans in the fridge from a couple nights ago, in fact. That's probably what we're going to end up doing. <gasps> you have returned from a nap. Mmm, love a nap. Let's come up here. Have I not committed any of these changes to source? Oh, no, I haven't. Oh, we'll get there. <clears throat> Was not long enough. They never are. All right, let's see. Vision save, uh, co work setup. Is that what I called this down here? I did. Look at me remembering things. <clears throat> All right. Um. <clears throat> um, header. There we go. Fritz, thanks for the lurk, buddy. And you cut the potatoes into bigger slices, cover them all open, especially like Greek and oregano, and take them in the oven until they're crispy. We'll boil them a bit before cutting. Mmm, yeah, if you do... Um, or after cutting, and if you boil them just for a minute, you can get them a little softer on the inside and then a little crispier on the outside. Mmm. Jinkar, thanks for the lurk, bud. Appreciate you. Okay. So, doop, doop, doop. And then... We'll go co work. Right. And Butter. Okay. <clears throat> so right, left, right. And then Perfect. Uh, yeah, that should be fine. Yeah, well, that's fine. I just like the little feedback. Even if it doesn't work, I like to have it there. It's nice. It makes me feel like things are happening. I'm a fan of it. And...
So. Yeah, okay, that's fine. Okie dokie, I want... We're gonna do this. All right, we're gonna duplicate that. Left, right, left, right. <clears throat> okay. All right. I'm trying to get as much of cuz right now the way that this page works in when it's served from the bottom this page here is some of the things that are on the page like the news bar here this is injected in when the page loads and I'm trying to get away from that so I'm starting to new things I'm Letting the page do on its own. <clears throat> All right, so do that, and then we'll set a Set interval. I don't think that'll work, will it? I don't think that like it'll like that. No, I don't think it will like that. <clears throat> it's all right, we'll figure it out. You know what? I'm not even worried about it. It's that's going to run so fast that it won't matter. Um, okay. Well, this is good. I like this. <clears throat> All right, now let's go rebuild the uh the stream admin and if i go here all right and now if we refresh this go work setups here
I'm going to change a couple of things here. Perfect. That's great. I love that. I love it. I love everything about it. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go take a quick two minute break, um, run a couple ads just so we can get ahead on it a little bit. And then, uh, I'll I'll leave the music running for for a few so uh I'll be back in a minute Okay. Loaf was in her spot by the curtain in our bedroom, being a kitty, so I had to give her pets. She made the cat activation noise, a little, a little chirp. Mm, cat aggro. Mm -hmm. Oh, she just a baby. What's this? Did I get an email about the? Uh... Ooh. Mm. 
Please verify. That's a bumblebee. Those are bumblebees. Oh, I'm a bumblebee. I'm a bumblebee who loves to eat KFC. Spare me the celery. Oh. Olive Guard is, uh... So listen, um, <clears throat> in case you're, in case you are a holiday kind of person and you're looking for something to get that special someone in your life who likes chain Italian American food, uh, Olive Garden will have a holiday collection coming out, uh, including a breadstick puzzle, some socks, not even sure what's going on over here, but also a Seasons Gratings Yo! sweatshirt. <clears throat> uh, Olive Garden is an Italian, it's an Italian-inspired American chain restaurant, is what it is. So they have, they have Italian-inspired dishes. Yeah. Yes. Bibbity and all the bobbities. That's correct. There you go. Uh, that looks like... Is that the salad? Is that what's going on there? I think so. Anyway. That's coming out uh, in a week. Mm, all right, we've got that going on there. I'm very happy about. Should we add anything else to this? Like... What's the main set to? Main is... You know what? Top, zero. Bottom, zero. Left, zero. Right, zero. But I want main to be... behind the... Yeah. All right, so what we're gonna do is, I would like to do a... Blurred background. I wonder if that, uh, hmm. God, I just had just the most ridiculous idea. Wonder, yeah, this this probably won't work, but Is that how you specify, like, what the pixelation should be on it? Hi, Louie. Louie, or I'm sorry, Ellie. Hi, Ellie. I see the name. 
it's an automatic response. Hi, Ellie. How are you? How are you feeling? Yeah, I don't think that's going to work. Down color. Um, let's go. No, I want. I guess I can do it that way. All right, we're going to do. Okay, that's fine. Does blur only work on images, maybe? Well, I didn't have a background color set. But also, yes, perhaps. Yeah, I think it only works on background images. I do like that though. Transparent stretch pixels and image. I don't know if that would work because it's transparent. That may be the problem. Let's backdrop filter. Oh, oh, I like that. Is this is a standard? Oh, it is standard. Well, maybe backdrop filter is what we need. Ah, so close. Uh, yeah, it can't do it because there's... Um, the element doesn't realize there's anything behind it, so it can't calculate the blur on it. I mean, that makes sense. That makes sense. That's a... That makes sense. But I do like this because then we can come over here for something like this and like. We could put it in theater mode. You can't you can't force the blur CKY because it's the browser element. It will try to blur anything behind it in the on the browser um canvas but there's the stuff that's behind it is um the only stuff that's behind it here is other obs elements and it can't blur that it doesn't know that to blur that there is an obs filter for it but well, let me see let's see if i can Default overlays. It's not complicated enough for me. It is not. Hmm. No. I could do a thing where I could add a blur to this. Effects, which would be a plugin. Okay. 
crop pad, there's mass blend. Oh, this is sharpen. Hmm. Let's see if there's a way to do. Yeah, okay. So these are all plugins. Damn. Okay. Yeah, that's that's all plugins. Which that's fine. I'm not terribly concerned about it. It was just, you know. Yeah, it looks like the only way to do that is through a plugin, which is, it's fine. I don't need that. That's, that's not important. <clears throat> and my throat is really drying out. I'm almost out, and I've been drinking plenty of it. <clears throat> I don't know if that would work, though, because it's not going to do, like, a an effect. <clears throat> I mean, I don't think... Try something dangerous and stupid. Please stop. Thank you. <clears throat> this is going to look terrible. Yeah, it just, that's fine. <clears throat> it was worth a shot. 
Is there a background effect? No. And Stack Overflow? This really is a web developer stream. I know, right? <clears throat> All right. That's fine. That's not a big deal. I could do... Yeah, that's, <clears throat> that's not bad. The idea, Liz, was just to have, like, something in the background so that, like, whatever's on the screen up there, because, you know, I wouldn't, I would be looking away. So I could have something like, say, um, this up, but have, like, a blur on it. So it's, like, it's there, but it's not, like, um, like, focal point. <clears throat> They deleted the AI art ad, but now people are roasting them on a different post. Good. Good. Drag them. Listen here. Listen here, Dennis. Oh my god. I mean, honestly, that's not the worst idea. Wait, I have an idea. I I bet there's I bet there's already one out there. <clears throat> um Oh, those are barcodes. I don't want those. <clears throat> what is this? Do I need the background? Well, that's the thing. I mean, I could do it, Liz, but the problem is the browser is the... the way that OBS does browser sources, so even if you do the browsers, it, it's just... <laughs> It's not gonna, there's a code pin. We're gonna do this. Hey, look at that. <clears throat> That's not bad. That's, I think I like this one better. There is always a code pin though. <clears throat> Let's go to code pin and see what we got. Oh, this is in Babel. No, it's really not any different. <clears throat> That's also not really any different. 
But if you did overflow hidden. Yeah, there you go. That's pretty good. I like that. Put it back, but it's not easy. Yeah, I'm, I'm not. Uh, it's it's not worth it. It's. I do like I do like a good matrix digital rain though. <clears throat> Oh, that's the compiled one. Can I do that? Oh, no, it doesn't like that either. That's yeah, fine. Donut shapes, you know, the princess spinning donut. Oh my god. <clears throat> Wait. Flying toasters. Flying toasters. Boy, you have to be a certain age to remember this shit. That is, that is fantastic. Using only CSS animations. Yeah. <clears throat> See? CKY knows. He was there when it was written. Yep, yep. Liz, you remember the flying toasters. New pair of slippers. One of the options came up. Searches Homer Simpson's head. Put your foot in the slipper through his mouth. Very, very... Yes. Yes, they are, Tom. <clears throat> I wonder if I wonder if they allow this to be iframed in. Let's find out. Iframe order zero. Nope. Width, 100%. Height, 100%. Pretty hilarious. After dark, yep. Wiki Simpsons and feet. God. Okay, there's a Marge one too. That's, yep. Mm, of course there is. You know what I need to do? It's the scaling on that. Can I can I scale an iframe? Scale content. Oh, I guess I could do a yeah, I could do that. Transform, scale. <clears throat> hey, hey, look at that, it works. <clears throat> internet finally comes back on curse you internet welcome back miss ellie
So, uh, I wonder if I could scale by three. Let's see what happens. Fucking flying toasters, I love that. And I position it lower. Uh, maybe. I'm not sure why it's. Why are you not working here, though, is what I want to know. Scale of four. Maybe it's just the way it's built. Yeah, I bet if I, I wonder if I scale it to five. And the percentages lower help. Not for that. I want it to, because I want the, the width and the height to extend the entire area. So if I reduce the percentages, it'll actually, eh, it's still cutting it off anyway. Uh, this one doesn't have a pin. This one is just the uh, the URL. It's probably just the way it doesn't like it in the iframe. Actually, if I extend the iframe, it might like it better. It might actually like it if I do... Here, let me send you the URL. There's the flying toasters. No, goodbye. We'll come back. Did I save that? I did. It likes it even less now. Ah, you know what? I don't even care. It's fine. I'm not going to leave it anyway. Okay, let's turn that off. <clears throat> Come back here. All right. No, 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 it's fine. I don't, I'm, I'm not going to keep it anyway. I was really just fucking around with it. I'm not going to keep the, uh, I'm not going to keep the flying toasters. Is this the same one? No, this is, this is a different, that's very different. That's, that's, that's very different. Nope. Wow, gadget. Wow. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Wow, 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 wow.
I want to see. You got a thing for this? That's a lot of work. No, I'm not doing that. Okay, it's fine. Yeah, listen, I was just, you know, fucking around with stuff. It's not a big deal. I just like that, like, wait, I gotta put the, the shade back on. <clears throat> Do we have a shade icon? I want to see if we have a shade icon. Lines. Lines open. Hmm. That's yeah, a thought. All right. That's a shade, and yeah, that's fine. That's pretty cool. I mean, I like that. Glasses? We mean glasses. Oh. Eh. No, I meant like I meant like blinds. That's what I was kind of thinking for, like shoo, pulling down the shade. Okay.
reinsuchen. Perfect. And now that's the messages. Now we do the shade, so we go Is this seriously the rainbow connection? Rainbows have nothing to hide. I know they're in the sea. Someday we'll find it, Rainbow Connection. Yeah, it really is. I fucking love that song. <clears throat> Answered, pushed on the morning star. Yeah, it really is. Ooh, Dennis, get some food, buddy. Thanks for the lurk. Watch the mass singer and the judges couldn't even hung up on up this night. They better fucking not. Ooh. Okay, this actually makes me want to play Tetris. Mm -hmm. 
That's good. I like that. Today with your internet, listen, it, everything's being janky. Chat keeps reconnecting in, in the OBS window, but only in OBS. Everywhere else seems to be okay. So, I don't know what's going on. Down here getting buffering even on your phone data? What the fuck? Yeah, that sounds maybe it's maybe it's Twitch just being a piece of shit and Let's come over here. Okay, that should work. Theoretically. Um, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Thank you. All right, let's run this. We've got an ad coming up in about three minutes. Just fair warning. All right. Nope. Cowork. Cowork shade status unknown. Right, because I don't have it. That's that one's on me. Holy shit, that works. All right, now the only thing I need to do is set up the refresh.
feel like I should probably put that script out at the end of the body. Or... No, you know what? I'll just do this. I'll go document dot add event listener um, loaded sync There we go. I like that better. Because at least that way it'll wait until everything's loaded, which is good. <clears throat> yeah. Fan of that. Big, big fan of that. All right, let's go... See what happens now. Yeah. Okay. I like that. Um, do I like the shade? Let's make it one second. Yeah, I like that. I like that. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I like that. Okay. So that pulls those, which is fine. That's all set up to work now. It's really nice. Okay. Thanks. I like it. And the buttons work, which I'm a big fan of. Yeah. Yeah, I can I can be okay with this. This is really good. I like this. I like everything about this. This is all great. I know it's a little, I mean, I know it's dark, but I mean, that's kind of the point if I want to pull the shade down, right? Like. Awesome.
honestly with YouTube like in theater mode, but the browser full screen. That's that's not bad. I can dig that. All right, let's pull the shade back up. I like this. Um, this is pretty great. Okay. The stream portal thing, is that all running inside Firebot? This, this admin page, this all runs inside of Firebot. Um, so I know it's a little hard to see. Um, but if you look here in the, the, the bar, um, it's got a, the integrations, you can see it's on 7472, which is the Firebot default port. And so this is actually being served up by Firebot. No, no, the domain is not externally available. That's correct. That's my local network. That's my local DNS. There are very few things on local DNS that are available outside. So. Like that, yeah, I. I was the guy that back in 2004, 2005, my router setup was internet coming into a server, going through, uh, running server 2000, Windows Server 2003, running the connection through Internet Security and Acceleration Server, ISA Server doing all of my rules and filterings and all of that shit there. And then going out through a different NIC to a switch, which also had a, a wireless access point attached to it. So all of my shit was going through ISA server and that was all of my filtering. Now it's yeah. Threat management gateway is what they, they used to call it, and that was the last name that they had for it. And that was ISIS server though, back way back in the day. Like ISIS server had all kinds of stuff. It had like this powerful ass firewall and routing. It had um, like load balancing and all kinds of shit that you could do with it. And it was, it was very, very well done. I even had a local exchange server that I ran for a while. Back in those days. Back when your dad still did server stuff. God damn it, Dennis. All right, well then, I'm pretty happy with this. Um, I don't know that there's much else I want to add to it, like... I yeah, I figured as much as I can use Firebot is why the hell not? Because that's why this is set up the way it is. That's why there's no that's that's why there's no uh, syntax highlighting here because this page is a string. The contents of this page, the contents of this page is a string. 
So when I test it, I have to build and reload it in Firebot. Um, do I have this? Is this public? I don't know. Maybe. Let's find out. Let's go to GitHub. Free egg for young from the English Learner Center. Ooh. Is this public? Uh, no, it is not public. Um, I mean, I could probably get it ready to be public at some point, but it's not currently public. It is currently private just because it's, this is, uh, this is my shit code. You know, and shit code. No one wants to see my shit code. It's shit code. hear a knocking sound but in the wall maybe someone's hammering something to tell webpack to load html file as a string yeah yeah this is what i do here just poop the page is a string and then what happens is in the actual plugin itself hey dennis you remember when i added that thing where you could add your own custom uh endpoints to the uh the h the internal http server for plugins this is exactly why i did it this is exactly why i did it was to facilitate this thing right here so i have the home page and this is what the home page does and there are a few things that i do here um Like, there are a few things that I pull, but other than that. Because, like, some of this shit, some of this is actually driven by text files, which is by design. But I need to, I need to add some additional stuff in here to, to update this shit. And you abuse that until you add a resource token. Yeah, I bet. Go on, CKY. What do you want? What are you doing? You can. What do you mean? You, I can what? You can add your own HTTP endpoints into the internal HTTP server in Firebot. And that's how this works. Come on. Where's it? Where's it? Why aren't you? Okay, now you're just pissing me off. There. As a, as a script, as a plugin, yes. So the, when plugins add it, it goes under integrations and you add a name and then a path. So in my case, the name of the integration, the prefix, you have a prefix that you usually typically use the same prefix for for all of your um your custom routes and then you have a path and you can do the path pretty much within like http limits and then you specify a prefix a path and a method and then when you register it you also add in whatever you want it to do when that requirement gets met and then what happens in Firebot is we come in here and this HTTP server manager that I, I built, oh my God. Can I just, uh, let's close the panel. So whenever someone comes in here and registers custom route, what we do is we take the prefix, we take the route, we take the method and whatever their callback is, because you have to have a callback back. And so we normalize the whole thing and we build out the actual, I build out the actual route for it. And so I have this build custom route parameters. 
we lowercase the all the whole thing um where we take actually i think yeah we take any uh trailing slashes and we take those out and uh we basically do a join path on it to get the full route so that comes back and then what we do here is basically what happens is we look and see if we have one of them already in our custom route table and if not we add it to custom routes then what happens is in the server we come in here and we have all of our default shit that's in here right so like all of our api shit that we add in the overlay overlay resources resource tokens shit like that and then what happens is if none of those match or if we i'm sorry if we do in a, if someone does integrations we then we go and we take that custom route and see what the matches are we get unregister custom effect or custom variable to unregister custom http routes no plugin has to do that that's that's under the hood plugin shit. That should not, that's something that should not be, yeah. Well, no, those are still requiring you to restart Firebot each time. They shouldn't. For unregistering custom routes, it shouldn't. You should be able to just do that in your plugin. And when the plugin loads, the plugin should tell it. Oh, oh, custom effects or custom variables. Oh, 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 oh. Um, that might be a, that might be a V6 thing. Why do all that when I just use the resource path? Cause I don't want just a resource. I want custom routes to do certain things. So like here, if I, okay, so like this, if I do a, a resource path, I can get just a raw data back, but this performs logic here, CKY. So I'm like, like getting, I'm getting stuff. I'm getting contents of pages and replacing, doing replacements before I send it back. Or like this, like here, I'm taking that, I'm doing a post here. So I'm taking the body that comes in from this i'm taking this lower third text saving it to a file path and doing all this logic on it so if i was just serving up a resource like just an image or something resources great use of that uh, a resource path is great use of this for this though i'm doing all of this logic so that's why i have the custom routes so i can have all this custom logic in here I enjoy it. I'm, you know, I got all my, my fancy majigs. I have a bunch of stuff that's in here. Cause like the stop doesn't, I don't think we call the stop today. Um, in core code. So there we go. Okay. We got that back in there now. So yeah. Um, so that's how, that's how that works. I can just inject that in. This is Firebot serves up all this and handles everything. This is all self-contained. So if Firebot stops, none of this works. But Firebot is like, it is absolutely the centerpiece of all of this. CKY, the main thing, like the, the, the application as a whole isn't really documented. Like there's a lot of stuff that like, um, like there's a tiny bit of old wiki and then there's like the videos that Apple did a while back, but those have been years ago. And so much of that is outdated now. Like we need new stuff, but I don't want to, I don't want to put in the effort to put in stuff for V5. You know what I mean? 
The code is the documentation. Stop that. Stop it. Stop that. Spoken like a true Linux user. Like it just it doesn't make it doesn't make sense to to put in all of that effort for v5 when v6 is going to change a lot of how all that works um it's just you know actually spoken like a true firebot dev get out of here see how reject's brain works listen no, none of us know how his re his brain works he is a a mystery wrapped in an enigma and covered with gravy. Delicious, delicious gravy. Alright, I don't need Postman anymore. Um, Alright, so... I think that's pretty much it. I mean, I can't think of anything else I want to do on this scene. Like, I like having the shade there. Like the shade's nice. Yeah, I think that's it. I think that's, I think we're good. In fact, you want to add, but can't. I mean, there, well, I've got a backlog of stuff that I'm waiting to add. We just, we've got other. I hate to say it, higher priority things that we need to get done. And there's so much stuff that I want to just dump in, but I can't yet. I have to wait. I need to wait. Because the stuff that we're waiting on needs to get done first. I am a little tempted to do... Mm. Poke the twerpal peeps. Uh, yeah, maybe you just want to sit back. Maybe you just want to sit back and wait on that one, pal. You know you don't want to poke them. You know it's just the one guy, and he doesn't like to be poked. He's got life going on. Let's see. That sounds like Minecraft. That is Minecraft. He's been devoured as well as an egg roll. Nice. Well done, Liz. Well done. Here's one thing that gives you hope for humanity anymore. I fucking... 
I miss cooking for large groups of people, and we are seriously considering doing Nomster Jam this coming year, uh, 2024. So Nomster Jam is, we always did on the Sunday of Memorial Day weekend at the end of May. And the last one we did was in 2019. Uh, that was the fifth one. This one would be, this coming one in 2024, would be Nomster Jam 10. And I am considering very, very much doing like a big to-do to bring it back in. And I don't know just yet. And so, I don't know. That's something we will have to figure out, but... I don't know. I don't want to be here and then think about maintaining it. Yeah, you don't want to. You don't want to do that. You do not want to do that, pal. How is it just a f I can never remember which one is which. Ah. It shouldn't be you shouldn't be changing that that often. Why are you changing that that often? Right, because I never put in a check for that. That's a lot of work on the DOM, so I'm going to change this. Nope, you know what? I'm going to let it be. I'm going to let it be. And things are built... Uh, maintaining shit systems that were built back in the 50s and 60s. Yeah, fuck that. And fuck that. And what kind of shit were you working on, like, COBOL and Fortran shit? Oh, because I made it absolute, I need to make that a thing. Oh, like Classic C, gotcha. No wonder you like Classic C so much. You moved it forward to C? Yeah. Let's go 20 pixels and see what happens. Uh, okay, y'all, thoughts on the image at the top, like up there. Does it look okay, or is it weird because the stuff is off-centered, like it's not even? You like it? Okay. Yeah, my my one hesitation is the fact that it's not even on both sides, but I mean it's going to be uneven anyway. You like it's 
You like that it's centered to the the content area? Okay. Guarantee large text can't clip. I'm never gonna put text large enough to clip there. Honestly, like this text that's up here right now, that's pushing it for me. I'm tempted to put one out the bottom too, but I don't know if that would be too much. Let's try it. What the hell? Let's go. Um, and there's a kitten. She came back. Hi, baby. What you doing? Oh, she's very sneaky. She's so sneaky. She's so sneaky. She's a sneaky cat. Hi, sweet girl. What you doing? Oh, sneaky loaf. Yeah, I know. There's all these lights in here, but it's very bright for a little kitty. Well, if she gets in the chair, I'll give you a loaf cam, but she hasn't been getting in the chair. Hi, uh, sweet. Oh, thank you. Oh, that's a big yawn. And now some nibbles. Oh, very good. Good job. Good job, baby. All right. I'll leave the classes in here. Okay. That works. Which one do I want? Uh, why do, why this? Because I don't name things properly. Uh, no, wait a second. All right, let's see how I broke this. Yeah, I gotta get it moved down though. It should be moved down. Oh, cause my height, cause of my height. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. Like, I worry I'm making it too busy now. I mean, it's not bad. I like it. Hi. Oh, yeah, is that right? Well, that's a good job. Very good. Thank you for telling me. Hello. Where's your chair? You want to get in the chair? Let me, see, let me see if I can get her in the chair. Hold on. You want to get in the chair?
She doesn't want to be in the chair. Thank you, girl. All right. What's she doing? Oh, well, let me. There we go. My sweet girl. What's she doing? Are you being very good? You're being very good. Yeah. Yeah. Hi. Hey, baby. Yeah, my loaf. That's my loaf. He's very snuggly today. Did you know that mommy's watching? Yeah, mom can see you. She loves you. Yeah, you're her favorite. You love to snuggle her, don't you? Yeah, you love that, mom. That's right. That's right. Yeah. That's my cuddle cat. Yeah. Hi, cuddler. Hi. What's your deal with? You being sweet girl? He's hanging out with Mr. Bear. There we go. There we go. Mwah. Love you. Good job. Good job. Oh, at some point I also want to change the, uh, the scene transition, too, because I hate it. It's been here for a while now. I hate it. She's done. Sweet, sweet girl. Is that right? Oh, thank you. That's a good kisses. Thank you. She's a very sweet kitten. Uh, all right. I think that's pretty much all I'm gonna do with that. Uh, I can't think of anything else I want to do. He wants pets all the time. I would love to give him all of the pets. I would give him every pets. But Buddy's a good boy. He's a good. He's a good fella. He deserves all the pets. Oh, he's such a good boy. All right. Uh, oh, did it? Did it float down there? All right. Um. Well, I mean, I think this is. Uh, I think this is pretty good. He does the best he can with his one brain cell. It's true. He does the best he can. I like this. What do y'all think? You think we made some good something good today? This would be good for future streams. I might change up the styling on it at some point, but I like where it is right now. Let's see. Yep, yep. Um, all right. So, hey, don't forget, we're still raising money for Trans Lifeline. We are just $300 shy of our goal. Uh, I am just absolutely floored by the support that we've gotten from all of you. Uh, thank you all all so much. This has just been absolutely wild. Uh, we are at... We are at 94% of our goal. Uh, and I'm just... What do you mean the tinting? You think it's too dark, CKY? I mean, the idea is it's... The idea is there will be something in the background that, like... I won't be interacting with. Like, just with the shade on. So, like, it'll just be... Like something like this, just on in the background. And then I'll be off to the side working on shit, so. While we just chill out here and and listen to stuff. Damn it, I gotta take the coffee thing out of rotation. Um, I wanna do that now while I'm thinking about it. 
Where's my timer? Rotating message. Potential effect. Uh, toggle enabled. Perfect. What's we got there? Um, that works. Okay. But yeah, the idea the idea is that this will just have like I'll be over here off to the side, just you know, being a body in the room while we chill out, listen to music, and work on whatever it is we're all working on. Um, so the shade will be there just to the shade will be there just so if we can. I mean, I can. I can lower it and raise it as I need to, but. Oh, hey, what else is fun is uh, my admin page. Uh, this guy right here. This is also set up as a dock in OBS. So pretty happy with that, that I can just use that in OBS. I mean, but that's the thing, CKY, I can... Is zoop. Zoop. Um, all right. So, what you doing? You doing a good bathers? It's a good job. Yeah, I love you. I love you. That's my loaf. Is that my loaf? Little kitty. Kitty. You a kitty? Yeah. Oh heck, a kitty. I love you. She's so cute. My God. All right, we'll wait till come back from ad break. Man, I just love, this is a great channel. Joanna, thank you for 25, let me turn that off. Joanna, thank you for $25 to Trans Lifeline. Thank you so, so much. We are now 97.5%. Wait, no, no, 94.5, 94.5%, I can count. I can count. Um. Yeah, yeah, CKY, let me, should I move that? Oh, I wonder if I should move that. Uh... Hmm. I wonder if I should move that behind or in front of the alerts. I don't know. Did I make the bot work with Twitch charity donations? Yeah, Dennis, I did that almost a year ago, right when it went into open beta. I, I like slammed that code in, like I pushed to get that shit in twerple and I slammed that code into Firebot like two days before my, uh, my stream anniversary at the beginning of December last year. So yeah, I absolutely did. Yeah. That's all part of the big, uh, uh, event sub update. That's, that's not out yet. Now, CKY, this is Twitch charity donations. This isn't Tiltify. This is the Twitch native ones that just came out last year. That's right, 5.6. 5 or 5.60. Yes, 5.60. That's, uh, that's the latest one. Ooh. God, I want to play Super Metroid. Ugh. Game Shops is so good. I love it. Legend of Synthwave. Oh, shit. Um, okay. 
So, uh, Johanna, thank you again for the $25 for Trans Lifeline. Thank you so, so very much. We are now just two seventy five dollars away from our $500 goal. Um, I I want to hit that by the end of the month, and I think we can. I think we absolutely can do it. We still have two weeks. Um, so we're going to get there. We've gotten so far already. We're, we are almost there. Um, thank you all again so much for hanging out today. Um, let's, let's skadoodle. Yeah. Yeah. Let's, let's go ahead and let's get ready to, to scoot. Um, I will be back tomorrow night. Um, I've gotten this all set up now, so I might be back to some gaming tomorrow night. I might do a retro stream again, because those are fun, and I really enjoy those quite a bit. And it lets me do things like use the TV, which I really enjoy doing. Um, so that's a, that's always a fun time. Um... There's CKY right now, buddy. They just need, we just need life to settle down. There's nothing else that, that anybody else can do for us right now. We appreciate the offers, but we just, we need life to calm down for us. And that's, that's it. That's, that's all we can do. Yes, Vivian. What is it, Vivian? What are you doing? You're, 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 you're a nerd, you nerd. Reverse. Yeah. Get Reverse. reversed, you nerd. Um, camera's on its way. Reverse! Reverse! How fucking dare you reverse my reverse? Who the hell do you think you are? Um, yeah, camera's on its way. It says it'll be here probably over the weekend sometime, but we'll see how that goes. Um, let's see what else. Uh, tomorrow night. Yep, back tomorrow night for new usual stuff. Might do a daytime on Wednesday. We'll see how that goes. Uh, I'm just playing it by ear. Daytime streams, no schedule. Uh, I do have to set up my live space co-streaming at some point. So, uh, I gotta figure out the logistics behind that. Because I want to make sure that the bot posts that. But also, live space is... You have to, live space does like YouTube where you have to tell it that you're live. You can't just start streaming. You have to be like, by the way, go live. So, uh, yeah, that's, I'll, I'll get to that when I get to that. Um, other than that, that is pretty much it. Uh, Okay, I will see y'all tomorrow night for some kind of a gamins. Uh, let's do. Uh, I mean they've they've done a lot of work on the site, Dennis. They have done. They've got dark mode. They got dark mode. Oh, the internet just came back. Listen, Twitch has been twitchy even like for me watching it. Uh, I've been having trouble with it myself today, so it has been kind of a pain in the ass. Um, that's okay. We're going to go raid somebody. We're going to raid somebody fun and great. Actually, I don't think we've raided this person before. You've been on the phone to your ISP? Ugh, gross. All right, we're going to go raid Avi. She's fantastic, and she's playing Super Metroid for the first time. Um, she's great. If you like our vibes, boy howdy. You'll love hers, and she has a cat cam that's more reliable than ours because her cats like to lay on the couch. So, I d boy howdy, do I love a Super Metroid. You are not kidding, pal. You are not fucking kidding. Um, hey, there's the raid message. Let's get ready to go sp spam Avi's chat with it uh, and give her lots of love because she's fantastic and can confirm cat cam is active over there so um all right um hey thank y'all as always for everything um i will see you tomorrow night for some kind of a gamins uh until then 
As always, please remember, be good to yourselves first and foremost, and be good to each other. And I will see you, uh, I'll see you tomorrow night. Bye.